Welcome to the COVID-19 edition of CSE 439-839, Robotics Algorithms and Applications. In this video, I wanted to go over some of the plan changes now that we can't be together. So on the course website in Canvas, there's a new version of the syllabus that outlines some of the changes to the course. So as you can see here, we're gonna to move to a fully online version of the course. And instead of having uh, an additional lab and homework, we're going to basically remove the labs since you've returned your robots. And instead, we're going to have most likely two additional homeworks and then uh, so a few online quizzes that will contribute to your participation score. Percentage breakdown now will be 25% for class lab and your online participation, including quizzes. 45% will be homework, so that's 15% for you know, each of the three homeworks. And we've already completed two, two labs in the class so far. So we'll not be having regular classes. Rather, most of the assignments will be based on readings and videos that I'll post on Canvas. However, I'm also going to have office hours over Zoom where we can talk over problems as a group. I'll be posting more information about that on Canvas in the coming weeks. In addition to these whole class office hours, you can also schedule a time to meet with me by going to carrick.youcanbook.me. So carrick.youcanbook.me. And here you can see what this looks like. Basically, what you do is go to the date that you want to meet with me, find a time that works, click on, on that time and that you want to start meeting with me, and then you can go on and actually book a time with me. So give that a, a try if you have any questions on how that works, or if you can't meet with me at that time but would like to meet at another time, let me know. Um, I'll be posting more information on all of this um, on Canvas in the near future. Uh, so make sure that you pay attention to what's going on on your Canvas account, enable notifications if you haven't already, and, and I'll be posting information there. In addition, if you haven't seen it with all of these announcements, you should definitely check out this website, uh, teaching.unl.edu slash keep learning. So this provides a lot of resources for you as students to figure out you know, how, how to make sure you can keep learning. And what you'll see is that one of the most important things listed here is actually communication. And I'm going to try to communicate regularly with you through these videos, Canvas, email, and also video office hours. So it's really important for you to also communicate with me so, um, you know, this is true if you have questions on assignments or if you have challenges with the course content or if you need to or if you'd like to give me some feedback on how I can approve the course or, you know, make it more smooth for you. So make sure to check out the site teaching.unl.edu slash keep learning if you haven't already. Offering this course online is going to be a learning process for me, and I'm sure we will have <laughs> but I'm looking forward to working together throughout the rest of the semester.